Right guys, so as you know, I'm a keyboard hoarder and uh, one of the popular posts that I have recently is this uh, real clutch keyboard that I've been using uh, a lot. I like it a lot and um, more recently I've been getting a lot of keyboards as well. I use the main keyboard here on my desk as you can see here. So yeah, and then now I have this setup here on the side. This is for my backup computer and I'll be traveling in the next few days. So I ordered another keyboard just to match this one. So I've been using this one here at home, but I need a full size one to be fully automated. Considering I'm, I'm, I'm traveling and I will be using this mainly, it has a decent screen, it's not calibrated, but I can respond to most of the concerns that we have online regarding work. So this time I ordered, I ordered this one to complement this one and I chose this one because of primarily the portability, full size and wireless. So let me open this up. Here you go. Alright, so I'm just going to adjust the camera a little bit so that you can see everything. Right, there you go. Uh, I hope you're seeing it. Um, yeah. Okay. So it's um, plug and play. It says there, but 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 it says I'm, I don't know how it's gonna be pronounced there. It's Mio. <laughs> Not sure, but it's a wireless uh, silent combo. It's looked like that on the photo. This is on the side here. All right. This is on the back. Uh, it says here a couple of things. Um, simple and elegant uh, PC dual mode adaptability so it works on Mac IPX4 waterproof plug and play so it has a dongle that is attached and that's how it looks and there's a green hint on the sides here right just on the other side so this is where I'm gonna open it up somebody has checked it already because there's a sort of tampering on the sticker so let me open it up as slowly as possible to be able to show you guys what's inside so first it's gonna greet you with the mouse all right as you can see here they already included some batteries so that's good all right two sets of battery so it's triple A and then on this side nothing else so you need to pull this tab here and then you have the manual and then uh, okay the keyboard itself All right okay let me put it here and then hey nothing else no charging cable nothing so it's battery operated I'm just gonna, yeah, before I proceed, I'm just gonna put it back together in the box. Okay, so, yeah, there you go. Okay, so we have, oops, what was that? It's the battery. Okay, so we have the mouse here, as you can see. So pretty much a nice looking mouse. Let me peel off the plastic. So it's pretty nice looking. I'm just going to turn the light a little bit towards it. Pretty nice looking with the red hint here. Right? Scroll wheel that uh, has some tactile feel. Silent clicks. On the bottom, there you go. Probably the dongle is hidden inside, including the battery compartment. And then the on-off button. So let me just check it out. So you just twist it and then drop it, right? So once it's opened, then you put in your battery in there, right? So I'm just gonna put in some AAA battery. So I can show you how it functions or how it lights up. Okay, give me a second here. Okay. You can hear the crackling of 
uh, batteries, so there you go. Mm -hmm. Okay. The wireless dongle is not here, so but you can keep it here inside. So I'm not sure why it's not included already inside, so I'm a little worried. <laughs> yeah, but anyway. Okay, maybe it's placed on the keyboard this time. So there you go, turn on, and it's lighting up. It's green. Right, so just let me turn off that one, put it aside, and prepare the other battery for probably the keyboard. So it still supports AAA. So don't worry when you buy it, the batteries are included. So let me go now to the keyboard. Okay. So it's a little messy now. Okay, so you have the keyboard here. Okay, so it's a full-size silent type keyboard, similar to your laptop keyboard, but it has a good play. And you can hear it's a little clickety, but it's good. Spacings are good, it's full size. Uh, indicators here, so on and so forth. That's on the side profile. Right? Okay, so there's adjustments on the bottom. As you can see here. Right? So pretty light and pretty compact. Okay? And then you just need to pull this tab here for the batteries. So as you can see, now I'm not worried because this is where the... Uh, transmitter receiver has been placed in on the keyboard and then you just add the battery in so that's the orientation of the battery it's probably gonna work immediately once you put in the batteries so it fell down the floor there you go okay and then I'm just gonna turn put it back in there's no switch, there's no visible switch. Oh, this there's one here. Okay. So you just need to turn it on. There's no lighting. If you expect some lighting there, it's gonna be shown here on the top corner. Uh, the keyboard doesn't have a light. Probably in the future versions they will. Right? So just gonna show you how quick it's gonna be. So uh, let me test it out. Okay, so here's my computer. I'm gonna turn it on. Right, just to show you how it works. Okay, so I'm just gonna plug this in. Okay, so without plugging in, I'm just gonna plug it in, see if it installs by itself. Okay, this one's already on. Right, so I'm not sure if it's gonna connect itself immediately after turning on. Okay, so I turn it on, and you see that it's working, right? So immediately after turning it on, it immediately works. So let me put in my password. So that's pretty much plug and play. There you go. And then the mouse, let me test this out with the same transmitter. And then, yeah, immediately it starts working, pretty sensitive. So just to show you that I'm minimizing this window using this mouse now, and there you go. So I'm gonna move the camera a little bit so that you show and show you the, the mouse working. There you go. I'm gonna close this window here. There you go. So everything's working fine. Pretty quick. That's around. You I plug it in and then there it is. So just after you use it, just turn it off to save battery power right and put it in your bag that's it i'm happy i'm gonna use this on my travel uh white keyboard this combination here pretty much works for me and that's it thanks for watching guys